What's up everybody? This is Allison from World Traveler HD. A lightweight North Face rain jacket, a zip up hoodie, standard weight, kind of like one of those American Apparel ones, a long sleeve t-shirt, and a cardigan. So if I didn't buy the compression cube, this would be the size that I would be putting into my pack. I wanted the compression cube because I want less volume in my backpack. Uh, the weight's obviously gonna be the same. So let's zip it up and see what it looks like. This is much, much smaller volume, very compressed as compared with the expanded version. So I'm loving this cube size. To show you what they look like in a day pack, I've got my Surge 2 out here by North Face. That's great. Let's try out the half cube. Okay, I have five t-shirts that I'm just hoping go in here, so I have no idea. I would say that's a perfect size for five t-shirts. If you're male and watching this, female clothes uh, are a little bit smaller than male clothes, but I'm almost six feet tall, so by no means um, are my clothes little tiny petite, like someone more petite than I. I wouldn't even think of that as a concern. But compressed down, whew, that wasn't even very challenging to zip it up. A lot easier than the other one, just I think because I have extra space in this. If you are planning a, let's say a backpacking trip through Europe or camper vanning New Zealand or around the world trip coming up, I have four long sleeve items, including a rain jacket and a lightweight fleece, and five t-shirts in here. I've kind of been thinking, how am I gonna bring all of this stuff? Now, after putting my items in here, I actually can't imagine not having these. This is gonna be so easy to pull in and out of my backpack. I could pop another half cube right here with, let's say, pants and shorts, and then I would have maybe a, I would purchase a quarter cube or something to throw in here of socks and underwear. And you could really have all of your clothes here in this day pack if you weren't carrying around other, other items. So for one last comparison, why don't I see what this volume clothes looks like unzipped and expanded? Unzipped and expanded. I don't think I could put another half cube in here like I thought I could with the compressed version. The cube took up a little bit more space. That means that I can't put the half cube like I thought I was going to. So that's fine, the, the weight's the same. Maybe you wouldn't wanna carry anything more anyways just because of the weight. A few t-shirts, you know, isn't too heavy. But if you did want more space, go with the compression cube because even though I have everything nicely in here, just that small amount of space is gonna take one more half cube out of my bag. They are a little bit pricier than the non-compression set, but if you're spending the money to get packing cubes anyways, just from seeing the difference between the non-compressed versus the compressed version, I would definitely spend the extra money to get this. Thanks for watching. See you next time. You could use this as like a pillow once it's filled up.